yeah, yeah. He was wrong. Yeah, he was wrong. But supposedly they are not uh, wrong. They cannot change fate. They just see it as it do is going to unfold. Yeah, he, he was wrong because we're here. And we can do whatever we wish. Uh, exactly. That's what he thought was going to happen, that we were going to die here. But we changed fate, and he was pretty struck or dumbstruck by it. Yeah. Okay, let's increase alchemy, because we have been failing that a lot. And time to pursue sorcery. Let's put a point in this. Now. Alright, that's not going to happen. Summon a fire gorta, yeah. Sound Fire Gorta has 10% plus 10% health and more damage. Uh, let's go with the Fire Gorta. I really need a companion to soak up my. Yeah, to tie our enemies. Yeah, I will kill him. I will, I won't back down. That man is going to die as soon as he stops being uh, central to a plot. Because he, he brought us here to die, I'm pretty sure. That was no... Coincidence. Summon file fire Gorta. Use magic to rapidly construct a fire Gorta who will fight at your side. Toggle. What does that mean? Toggle? Alright. Yeah, it's fire Gorta. Fire. Let me show you. It's not fire, no. Pretty sure it's not. Yeah, summon a fire Gorta, not a fire. Maybe that's what it's really pronounced, but I don't see. <laughs> there he is. Does he go into sneaking? Yeah, he sneaks as well. But he does look like he's made of fire. Yeah, I like companions. <laughs> In my Dragon Age uh, playthrough I always had the skeleton companion next to me. Yeah, a skeleton warrior. Ah, great. Yeah, I will be using this uh, companion uh, a lot. I can tell you that. I love those kinds of companions. But I would prefer Hikari to... to... Uh, to... Uh, Access that would make him look much more fierce, in my opinion. And yeah, I'm not going to forget his bullshit. He's just too dogmatic, too beholden to that uh, religion or whatever it is. 
that he professes the fate weaver. He just believes he fate has to unfold. It has to unfold. Whatever the consequences, it has to happen. Because it has been preordained. And I say, fuck that. It was preordained that I died. It was certainly not that I would come back from the death and start unrolling the threats of the kingdoms. Oh, he died. Okay, summoning the fire court is very quick. I was uh, a little worried. All right, we failed. Uh, we're going to fail again and we're going to get fucked. <coughs> I knew that. Well, at least we didn't get... A glowing a spectra. Uh, it does do to to glow damage. Yeah, the junk too low. Uh, this the junk. Junk. I need to visit a uh, merchant. Okay. Okay, let's summon the fire gourd up. Ah, shit. I didn't do anything, you bullshit weir. Just stood there looking. Motherfucker. I won't forget. I will carve that into my hands if I need to. You will die, Agarth. Agarth the betrayer, I name you. I will cut your head. The theater of fate. I never thought I'd see it. Yeah, you never thought because you didn't see yourself coming here, did you? I don't see any reason not to keep summoning it constantly. <laughs> it's 
especially if the cobalt's insist in ambushing me. What? Where did he go? He bailed on us again. Yeah, standing there and watching me is hard work, apparently. Okay, let's see what the theater of fate shows us. I hope it shows us Mr. Agarth being castrated or something. I really want to see him suffer. We fate we must never fully understood the power of this place. Seems there's a lot we don't understand. Yeah, like my wrath at this moment. I could punch the computer. Oh, okay. I should have brought another bottle. Yeah, you go and fight it. Do something good for a change. Okay, one is coming for me. <laughs> Oh, right. That thing is relentless. Okay, it's in not to fire. It's in not to retreat. Holy shit. Well, he ran away. Uh, that's good. Maybe we can attack it from our hiding position. <laughs> Reckoning, no. What if another monster appears? can kill them from here very easily. Okay. Apparently it got fucked because we are far away. I guess. Okay, let's escape because it's not With going. With it, the Fae taught the Fate Weavers the answers to the deepest mysteries of fate. Put your hands on the stone, and maybe we can find answers to your own mysteries. Uh. Ah, you thought the the the, <laughs> the reckoning was scripted. Okay, what were those fucking things? The Niskaru are hideous creatures of chaos and corruption. They hated the Arathi, but unlike them, the Niskaru still stalk our world. Thankfully, they've mostly been driven back from the Feylands, but you still find a few lurking deep underground. Yeah, a few. Tell me how the destiny is This temple was built by the Arathi. And it's been here as long as recorded history. But the Destiny Stone was made by the first Fate Weavers. The legends say that they drew on ageless wisdom to build the stone. But with our order so scattered now, it hasn't been used in years. Maybe the Fate Weavers were originally able to weave fate. But they just became underpowered with the passage of time. So what am I supposed to do here? Besides not dying? Just put your hand on the destiny stone. It'll show me where you fit into the tapestry of fate. 
Yeah. I don't like that. I know where you want me to fit. That's all I need to know. Map. To touch the destiny stone. Bring news to children. Keep record the artifacts. Okay, let's go and touch the stone. With our defty fingers. At first loot, loot, loot. The signet of daybreak. Plus five damage during daytime. But we're not going to use that. <laughs> Take. Well, you know, I should have used one of those experience boosters. Yeah. He wants me to touch his hard cold stone. So it reacts. So it can glow and surprise me with all its might and virility. Okay, let's touch the fucking stone. But let's save first. <laughs> <laughs> 